We've recently been really focused on training our pre-competitive team and even our recreational classes with the end goal in mind of having them really comfortable with bar shaping that is necessary for upper level gymnastics or even intermediate level gymnastics. I have three gymnasts with me today that will be performing the drills that we do for beginner bar training. You'll notice that these drills are very similar to the ones we do with competitive team as they are just modified, more fun versions of the same drills. Put the animal in between her knees and try and get her feet up off the ground. Come on, Peggy Peanut. Good try. Can you put in between your knees and squeeze those knees together? And go into a tough body position and push. Good work. Peggy Peanut is working a very similar drill to the one that we have our gold athlete Skippy performing to develop their lower abs. This next drill that I have one of my pre-competitive athletes performing works the push down on the bar at the end of skills such as the forward stride circle and is also working to develop her lower abs. In the modified version of this popular kip drill, the goal is to have the athlete hold their feet above the animal as they roll up. Here is the kip drill that we modified to create that conditioning station. In an easier version of the straight arm pull down for the kip, we have our pre-team athlete performing the jump to front support, trying to jump up and then over the bar using straight arms. Sushi Pancake has just begun learning her kip, and this is one of the drills that we use to mimic the ending of the kip, keeping the feet in front and the arms pulling down straight. Maddie Maddie, a beginner gymnast, is working on pressing the bar down in a front support body position. This is really important later on in their career when they are doing straddle cast to handstands. And then here is the more difficult version of that drill for the cast to handstand. Chaco here is pressed all the way up, well she fell, pressed all the way up onto her thighs and then straddling her legs to either side of her hands and pulling them back into the middle. If you would like to learn more about how we teach our recreational and pre team athletes with the end goal of competitive gymnastics in mind, then visit our blog, Chalk It Up Coaching. A link can be found below.